hi guys welcome to my channel so on today's video i will be sharing with you guys how i prepare and apply my avocado protein hair mask and also i'll be sharing with you guys some of the benefits of the ingredients i use if you want to see all of that keep watching For the ingredients, I'm going to be using two avocado. I'm using two avocado because my hair is thick and so I want it generously applied on my hair. I'm going to be using an egg, castor oil which is optional. You can choose to go in with it or not, that's okay. Some olive oil and the aloe vera shampoo. Use it when I want to wash my hair after applying the mask. Begin by peeling my avocado and I will slice it in a plate. Then I go in with two tablespoons of olive oil. I will blend that together. Into my already blended avocado, I'm going to go in with two teaspoons of castor oil. I'll go in with the egg. I'll go in with one tablespoon of olive oil. Then I'm just going to mix that all together evenly. As you can see it's properly mixed, I'll go ahead and apply it on my hair and I'll begin by sectioning my hair so that it will be easy for me to apply the treatment. I'm just going to cut my hair into sections and apply it I just make sure it gets right into my hair into my scalp and I massage it all the way inside and make sure it touches every strand of my hair that's possible why applying it let me share with you guys more the benefits of the ingredients I used I'll be starting with the main ingredients which is avocado. Avocado is rich in a lot of vitamins that cannot reach the scalp and help hair to look healthy, shiny and hydrated. Avocado contains minerals such as magnesium and potassium which may seal cuticle cells which can help hair look smooth and shiny and prevent it from damaging and breaking. Contain vitamin A and E and other nutrients is said to keep the hair thick and healthy. The yolk is loaded with healthy fats which helps replenish moisture and makes strands look sleek and shiny. Moving to olive oil, I don't actually have any hair treatment, I don't add olive oil to it. Anyways, olive oil is high in antioxidant content and it helps to maintain scalp and hair health. It prevents the hair from cell damage and nourishes and conditions the hair at the same time to improve its quality. Of course, castor oil, which is optional, you can choose to go without it. Castor oil has antimicrobial properties, which helps to keep the hair out of harmful bacteria and protect the scalp from diseases and infection. You want to make sure your scalp is protected from bacteria. After applying the avocado treatment on my hair, I massage it into my scalp, massage it, just massage my hair generally. Then I try to detangle it with my fingers, then I use a comb to limit hair breakage. At this point, my hands hurt so much, but we have to keep going. No pain, no gain. I don't know if you guys have noticed but my hair has greatly increased in length anyways I took measurements of my hair before I jumped into the taking care of my hair and guys I'm so happy I'm proud to see it's working like it's definitely working this treatment this routines like I'm so enjoying it after applying the avocado treatment on my hair I massage it into my scalp massage it just massage my hair generally then I try to detangle it with my fingers then i use a comb to limit hair breakage 
I'm just going to follow the same procedure on the other sections of my hair. Well, I thank God I didn't put on any attractive dress. Like before I even finished applying a hair mask, I was already, my whole body was a mess. My shoulders, my dress was already dirty. I was just waiting to finish applying it, then I would change. And yes, because the whole thing was, I was just so messed up. So you want to make sure you take note of that. Massaging it into your scalp increases blood circulation which stimulates the hair follicles to grow, for new strands to grow and for of course for your length of the hair to increase. I've been like this for like two hours so immediately I covered my hair, I filled water inside a bucket and I just want to wash my hair because it's very important to wash your hair in cold water. Like it once happened to me, I used the egg treatment, egg on my hair and I used warm water which didn't actually go well so i'm conscious of that so i actually carry water inside a bucket and it's cold so that's what i'll be using to wash my hair if you're in dubai or if you're out of dubai by the way we are in summer right now and it's very hot like extremely hot and the water turns to be hot even when you turn the shower to the cold side it's still hot like i don't even understand so it's a no to use the shower so I carry water inside the bucket that's what I'll be using and I'll just wash it down in the sink and that's it and I'm just going to wash this out it's so soft <laughs> it's looking so soft uh, this is my bucket of water in Dubai <laughs> oh my god so that's it for the video if you love it please give it a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed please subscribe and join the family and of course i'll see you in the next video bye